See you in my dreams. Wait, 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 wait. We'll see. C-tier we'll see. C-tier Netflix movie. <laughs> you comfortable sitting like that? <sighs> yeah. Cross legged on the couch. I was never able to do that. Yeah. So, I wouldn't even what, I'm, what, I'm what, uncomfortable what? with you sitting this way Why? because because I can't. I'm comfortable. <laughs> Shouldn't it be about my comfort? <laughs> If you're comfortable this way and I'm comfortable this way, that should be fine. <laughs> okay, fine. All right. Yeah, but like this is, what, what, this is not what? fun for me. What do you mean? How do you want? Because we always sit this way. <laughs> what way? You Cuddle. never sit this way. Okay. I do. Well, how do you, you want me more up straight, <laughs> straightforward sitting? Yeah. Okay. Well, you're able to go into like half lotus. It's impressive. <laughs> Welcome to Spoonsville. <laughs> And we're Hi. doing a review. This is going to be something that we do where we also review. We review all movies. There is nothing we won't review. Actually, this is what's going on. All right, let's let me let's give you a backstory. Yeah. We have wanted to start this channel for a while. I've been the problem because I'm very. I feel like you guys probably can already tell that he's more easy breezy. It's just because I I'm really nervous and i have a lot of anxiety about it's hard to put yourself out yeah there. it's hard okay that's the only reason i'm not you know yeah i don't know i just um i know that people often a lot of times think i'm a serious person but anyway this is why i was more reluctant to start the channel than he was he's we we both wanted to do it but he took i mean i took forever coming around to it and so when we did finally come around to it we decided that we are gonna before we actually start reviewing movies we decided that we're not allowed to watch any movie that we would want to review on our channel right. so we love movies and so, so a lot tough. of so it's tough not to watch movies so we're no. like okay we'll watch the bad movies the worst movies yeah. ever hallmark kind of yeah yeah because before starting the channel there were some movies that we really liked and we wanted to react or review them mm -hmm right after watching them just to get the authenticity of our emotions yeah you know it's captured fresh. captured on the camera um so that's why we didn't want to watch movies and we've been we've sat through a lot of tough <laughs> tough movies mm -hmm. and so this uh morning not morning what time is it now it's 1 p.m we decided to <sighs> watch one movie yeah that um, the netflix movie that we probably scrolled by a couple times yeah it was because i thought diane keaton was in it that's not it's Gwyneth yeah, paltrow's but it's mom not. it's Gwyneth paltrow's mom and that's the most you know, interesting thing about that's them. the most <laughs> interesting thing oh well that guy too the guy. what's his name um this uh, the guy who he's was in a star is born yeah he's the brother of bradley cooper yeah that's the best thing I could, I, yeah. yeah i don't know why that it was movie. made we're not really sure it was greenlit somehow yeah people will put some time into it not enough we don't. Uh, what's what, the name of the movie? I'm gonna see you. I, well, I'll. We don't. I'll see sure. you in my dreams. We'll see you uh, in my dreams. We'll see you. It was from yeah, something like that, and it was slow to start, and then it, it uh, picked up a little. All right, there we go. Life Danner. Oh. I'll see you in my dreams. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. Yeah, okay. Yeah. There we go. We got it. So, the movie stars Blythe Danner, and she's a lady. Yeah. Who, whose husband passed away 20 years ago. Yeah. So she just d doesn't do much quiet life. Yeah. She, Dog dies at the beginning of the movie. She's sad, but not sad like she'd want to. There's not really much to say that happens in the movie. Yeah. There's this awkward, confusing pseudo interest in the pool guy. And he's also kind of pseudo interested back. Um, they form a friendship. Because he keeps coming around to do the pool. They eventually just start drinking together. They go to Going karaoke. Out, they live in California. Yeah. He's moved back there because his mom is past, is dying or sick. Yeah. I would say that's probably the most interesting uh, Yeah. There was a conversation they had about life, basically. And, you know, kind of how you prepare for... Or it's like life is about just getting ready for death, I guess. I'm going to try to be respectful here. The, the sparks were... Not there. Not at all. Now, you could ask us, well, then why are, why did we watch it? Why are we talking about it? We talked, we, we told them, we told them why we're watching yeah. it because we were, these it are fillers. Was, it's, it was, it was just, a, it was, it was a disappointment. It's, it's, it's an interesting, I'm trying to explain it because it's kind of a numbness. It makes me feel very numb. The, the, the most interesting conversations in the movie Kind of just make me think of, yeah, what am I doing with my life watching this movie? So this is, here's the, the plot of the movie. We at least need, get, need yeah. to give people that. As yeah. bad as a movie as it was, yeah. 
the movie stars Gwyneth Paltrow's mom, um, and she has a dog. The dog dies. After, oh, she also has four friends that she hangs out with. They stay at a yeah. retirement home, and they try to convince her to stay there, but she doesn't want to stay there. She stays on her own. She goes to visit them every now and then, um, and they talk about, you should stay here be to meet guys, etc. Then um, there's the pool guy. They become friends. The pool guy befriends the lady, Gwyneth Paltrow's mom. I don't remember her name. And then they start going out, hanging out, drinking together, karaokeing together. Not a lot happens. Not a lot English. happens there. And then, um, then Gwyneth Paltrow's mom meets this guy, Bill. They meet and then, you know, they hit it off and he's single. Her husband, Gwyneth, Gwyneth Paltrow's mom's husband has passed. Yeah. Uh, 20 years ago, Actually, she retired too because he was a lawyer, had a lot of money. She retired off of his insurance. Yeah. She has a daughter who's far away and it that's was, about it. It was, yeah, that's it. Then then Bill dies randomly, unexpectedly. They never they, explain wait, what happens. Yeah, well, they, I'm giving the whole they, thing. Died, and then they she meet. Just, yeah. They meet. Bill, you know, woos her. Yeah. T you know, they go out. They actually, kind of, they get along. They get along. They decide to keep hanging out. Yeah, Bill has a boat. He takes her out, all the, these the, things, The pool right? guy comes by to say he's not working anymore. And then there's kind of this awkward as if they're breaking up, even though they were never together in the first yeah, place. Yeah, and the pool guy shows up. Why? Um, this is after the date with Bill, right? They um, sleep together and it's fantastic. Um, they're having breakfast in the morning, Bill and Gwyneth Paltrow's mom. And then the pool guy shows up. You know, and it's all weird. Yeah. I didn't. I didn't like any of what was going on. It yeah. Was, I, I didn't. I didn't. I didn't like it. Gwyneth Paltrow's mom tells her daughter about this guy because the daughter can tell. You know, there's something you're different, right? Oh, there's this amazing guy. Oh, he's so special, right? You know, all that stuff. And all of a sudden, we get a call, and then we find out that Bill's dead. That's it. She's sad. Hangs out with the pool guy. Gets a new dog. The end, yeah. The end of the movie. Yeah. Right. You think when Bill dies. That's the end of the movie. That would have been great. Yeah, there was only like 20 minutes. We had Bill for like, what, five minutes of the movie? Yeah. It felt like this was a personal project that should never have actually been released. Yeah. It also felt like Bill, the, the, the guy, the actor who plays Bill, he, maybe he just decided, this is awful. I I am better than this. Yeah. I was in A Star Is Born. Yeah, I'm quitting my And concert. I I can't. I yeah, don't just care. Kill me off. Should have just gotten a new dog because the dog died in the beginning. In the end, the last scene is her getting a new dog. And she's happy. And she's happy. She's super happy. And so we were just kind of like, this is a man's best friend type of movie, maybe. Yeah. Very con uh, th there was, it was tough to hold, to latch on to anything. Not much to latch. No latching going on on my end. Yeah, no latching. It was... Uh, Not a latch-worthy movie. The point is this, right? I think if it's supposed to be, if it's a B-tier movie... Let it be that. Yeah. I wasn't here expecting some yeah. profound Have them have, them have a wedding experience. and everyone you know what I mean? gets together at yeah. the end. Yeah, because Bill talks about getting married. Yeah. They should have just gotten married. No, maybe, maybe and it's... And that's it. I think maybe they were really hoping that it would come together better and they were like, yeah, but yeah. you know what? Sometimes life just doesn't end up like that. This yeah. ain't a happy, perfectly tied up together movie. You're just going to have to do with life being hard and gritty yeah. and shitty. The problem is the movie wasn't done well, so... Exactly. It didn't make you feel like, wow, that was real. That was real. Yeah. We should have just not had to be so perplexed. Yeah. Yeah. There's nothing. It's arid. It's dry. It's, yeah. Uh, it's, it was just uh, so unnecessary, yeah. honestly. Um, you know how you watch Hallmark movies knowing that they're not, you know, these incredibly, yeah. incredible work works of art. You know what I mean? It's not like a Schindler's List type of movie. Yeah. It's just a Hallmark movie, yeah. but you watch it because it's a Hallmark movie. Yeah. And so we were don't watching Don't try to that. be anything you're not. Don't try to be what you're not. Uh, now, we now probably we should just... have known what we were getting into again. Never heard a peep about this movie. Yeah. So there are reasons, but, you know. But yeah, so that's that's about that. Didn't expect oh, much. Okay. Worse than I expected. Way worse than we expected. Yeah. Yeah. I'd give it a, like a 14 out of 100. <laughs> And that's being generous. That's being generous just because, yeah. I don't know, it's Saturday. Yeah, it's because it's Feeling Saturday. Okay. It's Feeling uh, pretty good. Yeah. I'm tired now. It's, it's, it's a tiring movie. It's a tiring movie because it just felt so pointless, needless, uh, feckless even. Uh, I'm trying to think of other words that describe 
being tired uh, of the mediocrity of the not even mediocre. It was it was such a non movie. A not you know it was a non movie. Does that make sense? We knew what we were getting ourselves into, yeah. and we were fine with it. Yeah. But like you there was, turned it into movie, just a mess. Yeah. There was those movies where there's other. It seemed like it wanted to be that movie uh, with uh, what? What are their faces? You know, Robert Redford and and Netflix. It's also on Netflix. It's another movie. Two older people get together and they start a relationship. And that movie, while not the most satisfying, it was like there was I don't know some moments that kind of warmed your cockles a little bit. <laughs> yeah. Have a theme. Yeah, Find have a, a theme, theme, pick a theme. You did not have the a theme. theme. You didn't hold to the theme. Yeah. You didn't have a theme to begin with. You didn't have a theme to begin with because. Look for a theme. Be a theme. Yeah. Do the theme. Yeah. And I'm off put. Yeah. You put me off. Yeah. So. I'm, I'm feeling the off puttedness. I don't know. You had Sam Elliott. Man. Yeah. Do something. Right. Do something with Elliott. He really deserves better. Yeah. There were just so many balls um, that were dropped all at once that it made yeah. me shudder. I, I don't know. I don't know. I don't... Yeah. I don't know what to say. Yeah. Nothing made sense in the movie. Should have been destroyed. Yeah. All it should have... Should have been erased. Yeah. yeah. The last 20 minutes yeah. were a waste of time. I'm changing my rating. I give it a 9 out of 100. Yeah. We'll see you. We'll see you. That was that. I'll see you in your dreams. I'll see you. Yeah, I'll see you. I'll see that, you in... That movie. That movie by yeah. Gwyneth Paltrow's mom. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah. Yeah, that's it. Thank right. you. Thanks, thanks for uh, <laughs> sticking yeah, with it the way we stick with it. Yeah. 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 Bye. That's a wrap. <laughs> uh, How long was that one? I don't know.